A jury has found former Nisswa Mayor Fred Heidman guilty of misdemeanor disorderly conduct. The charge stems from a situation where Heidman confronted officers in August of 2020 after they stopped a vehicle in front of Heidman's business. Heidman swore and was verbally critical of the officers for making the stop. He was cited for obstruction of the legal process and disorderly conduct after officers told him to stand back away from the highway and he approached the vehicle that was stopped. We have an issue when we have a, a law, disorderly conduct, and the, the statute that defines it that's so vague and open that someone expressing an opinion, maybe using colorful language, can get brought into court and, and tried and convicted of it. That's a, that's a problem, and I think that law really needs to be fixed because it's not working the way it is now. It concerns me that at the time Mr. Heidman was the mayor and that there were policy disagreements within the city between Mr. Heidman and the, and the police department about how the police department should be handling policing. And, you know, that's a, that's a political disagreement. And the, the mayor of a city, part of their job is to offer opinions on how the city and how its departments should run. And it, it's concerning when, you know, he gets in an argument, he argues a couple choice words, and next thing you know, we got a, we got a criminal case going. That's, that's concerning to me because I, you know, the language may not have been perfect, but I've been guilty of using less than perfect language, but I, that shouldn't be a crime. Sentencing is set for May 12th. The obstruction of legal process misdemeanor Heidman was also initially charged with was dropped in December of 2020. Lakeland News is member supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.